I worked briefly at a West Marine, we had a little section of wall. It was just nothing but little gizmos to hang your fenders and adjust their height easily. I used to laugh at it. People were constantly coming up there. I had one customer once staring at it for a while and asking how this one worked and how that one worked. And then he asked me, he goes, well, what's your favorite one? <laughs> this, is why, this is why West Marine probably was yeah. happy I left because oh, no. my job is to just sell them something, right? But he made the mistake of asking it the correct way. All right, yeah. what do you like on your own boat? Well, now you're also coming to a West Marine for maybe some knowledge. I thought it was my duty to give them knowledge. And I said, my favorite one is a clovefish, <laughs> which is not sold on this wall of parts. Oh, God. And he said, wow. Well, you know, and I said, it's, it's such an easy knot to tie. I think a bowl and a clovefish, a half hitch, of course. Um, I really think a bum line hitch is handy for a sailor to know. Yeah, what was my fifth one? I had a fifth one. Oh, a square knot, you know, for yep. reefing and things. Yeah, well, little knots. Heck, you tie your shoes, you already know how to do a square knot. <laughs> and a power boater really just needs three. Yep. A bowling, a half hitch, yep. for just tying a boat to a piling or something. And uh, a clove hitch. Uh, in my, that's my opinion. That's hmm. right. A modern boat, power boater should, should probably know three knots. Sail boater would be great if they knew all those five I mentioned. But even if you just know those three that the power boater knows, you're better off than some of the then, sailors I've come across. Wow. Something else that very few people seem to know how to do, and I don't consider it a knot, to lay a line to a cleat properly. Yeah, I've seen boats on docks where you know that the line's not going to hold. <laughs> how many boats I've gotten on, and their stopper knot is just an overhand knot, thumb knot. Oh. It's not a figure eight. Okay? Yeah, not even it's a figure a, eight. Uh, good luck getting those apart. Plus, they're not as big. A figure eight knot is a stopper knot. It can get all jammed up and yep. you can still break its back like a bowline and yep. get it apart. Plus it's a physically thicker knot. A power boater doesn't need to know that knot necessarily. Uh, but that's just, you know, the world according to Mark. <laughs> I'm sure if you asked uh, five other professionals, you might get five different answers. <laughs>